why do the Taiwanese elections matter to you as well? 13 January, Taiwan will elect its president and its parliament. Uh, China and Taiwan is one of the biggest conflicts uh, in the region and one of the biggest flashpoints in the region as well. And the elections will influence the relationship between China and Taiwan. So it will also influence the level of tensions between the two. Taiwan is important for the Netherlands as well because Taiwan is one of the biggest uh, buyers of our semiconductor industry and also because a lot of trade goes through the region. Taiwan is important from a military perspective as well as the balance of power would change in the region if China were able to gain control over Taiwan. And then lastly, Taiwan positions itself as the democracy in the fight against authoritarianism, in other words, China. How do the leading candidates view China? There are three presidential candidates in the elections. We have the ruling Democratic Progressive Party with Lai Jingde, and they're very wary of China. Uh, they lean more towards the US and China is not happy with this party. Then we have the nationalistic Kuomintang with Ho Yi, and this is China's preferred candidate. They're more friendly towards China and more skeptical of the US. The wild card in the elections is the TPP, the Taiwan's People's Party with Ko Wenzhe. And he's a real populist and he said a lot of things, but it's actually kind of unclear what he wants with China. How does China view this election? China does not want the ruling DPP to win the elections again, and it will do everything in its power to prevent this. Uh, it has a lot of tools in its arsenal, from disinformation campaigns to military pressure, sending ships and aircraft to the region, and also economic sanctions. The election outcome will change the dynamic between China and Taiwan, but it is not the case that China will immediately invade Taiwan if the TPP would win again, if not for the fact that China does not have the military capability right now. The main problem in the relationship between China and Taiwan will persist. China wants reunification with Taiwan and there's no support in Taiwan for this, not among any of the parties. A lot of voters actually aren't voting on China policy, but are voting on the economic and domestic policy, especially the youth.